to my penthouse and then I shrugged it. Hello everyone and welcome to the Rant Rage Podcast, the first ever installment. Oh dear. And we have a lot of things to talk about. I'm your host, King HD Games. And Danger to Wait, the inventor of the <laughs> Rant Rage. So uh, let's, let's, what are we gonna talk about, dog? What are we gonna talk about? Talk about? Uh, well, we're also speak, uh, featuring a special guest, Colossal is crazy. So. Say hello, Colossal. Hello, you <laughs> schmuck. I can't even, I don't even do a voice. <laughs> yeah, he's not on this podcast. We're too broke to get him on here. <laughs> 36 up. We have combined, what? <laughs> Um, I 47 think. subscribers, I think. No, yeah. 50. I don't um, upload on my channel. You've uploaded like two seconds of a fucking meme. <laughs> Anyways, so your channel's a joke. My channel's basically dead. <laughs> and we're not going to speak of uh, Davis's channel because that is bad. He might come on sometimes, those of you wondering. Anyways, um, so yeah. Hold on. Well, we have a lot of uh, good things planned here today. So the first thing we're going to rant about is. A trend that has took over the nation, well, it's dominated by, it dominated the whole entire fucking world, but, you know, it's a good. It's Today a good. we'll be talking about the one, the only, the free Battle Royale game that every other one is copying, even though PUBG was created first. We will be talking about the free-to-play Fortnite. We were going to make a, a full-blown rant wage of this. Uh, the, an actual video. But, but uh, that would just give it more attention by me. Actually. It's, it's the most popular thing on YouTube. By that we mean we're lazy cunts. Uh, what's your opinions on Fortnite, Douglas? Go on. Well, my opinion on the topic is I don't enjoy it. I do not enjoy it. I played it a couple of times and I don't feel that fun factor that I usually do, unlike. PUBG. PUBG, it's more <coughs> realistic, and I like the more realistic. Don't get me wrong, Fortnite's fun when uh you have a when you actually when you actually interact with people. Yeah, yeah. I've played three games of Fortnite at someone else's at and, someone's house. And I really enjoy the um the modes where it's like big team battles, like fifty v fifty and twenty five squads, and I I really enjoy it, but. Besides the squads, duos, and solo, it's not really my thing. PUBG's more my thing. But, I gotta say it is fun. I'm just sad that the company Epic Games went from making Gears of War the most bloodiest game series to ever release on Xbox 360 to this going to -to free-to-play battle royale genre. I mean, they're making money from V-Bucks because... YouTubers are clicking the hell out of how to get free V Bucks. Also, Danger Dude 08, have you seen um have you seen those ads on YouTube videos where it's like get free V Bucks and they told you to I have not gotten those ads, surprisingly. I've heard about them, I've seen them like like ads appear as a video, but I've not actually gotten one on a video as mm. a full blown ad. Which suggests to me that the payday of a V Bucks based advert is is still not that appealing to well, people I'm, of the general public. It, it's still not that. It's also for other games like Grand Theft Auto, and it shows a clickbait thumbnail of like a person having millions and millions of dollars, and then they tell you to go to this ad and they verify you're they're gonna verify your account or something like or some bullshit like that and on top of that when it says it it's like oh you need to buy like a sponsor or something to help you get points to get get good to give us uh for us to give you the the currency but i'm surprised that epic games hasn't took action about this because if this is if this is actually giving away a free V box on I'm, I'm surprised that Epic Games hasn't started um uh well, the, taking them down. The fact that this isn't I've never tried it, so I assume that it doesn't give you free V box. Unless you're the luckiest bastard on the planet. 
And they um, always have these bots run through the system, like Sam Tony from Africa uh, uh, just gained 2,000 V-Bucks or some... Or some how much is 2,000 V-Bucks in your life, like real life money? Like, how much does that get you? Like, that's not a lot. 2,000? That's not a lot of V-Bucks, actually. You know, 1,000 V-Bucks is... Because the battle pass is uh, 950 V bucks, and why not a why not a full of thousand, Doug? I, I don't know, but anyways, there's a thousand V bucks. So if you were to buy the a thousand V bucks and get the battle pass, you would only have 50 left. But you can just wipe your ass with those uh, bucks. Yeah, I mean they're practically they're practically um, video game Bitcoin at this point. It's, yeah, basically, it's, it's astonishing. Um, <laughs> You know, it's... But they're asking you to odd. spend $10 on V-Bucks. And, and the $10 purchase for V-Bucks oh no, is 1,000 V-Bucks. You can't own V-Bucks. Yeah, if maybe they had a system like PUBG where you earn co uh, coins based on your kills, your ranking, like in a solo duo or squads, if they gave out V-Bucks every time you won... Then maybe it would be better. Maybe I would come back to the game. Because I don't want to spend money on it. I, I just don't like it. Yes, and speaking of video games, God of War just came out. God of War. I was never really a PlayStation fan, but... Me neither. I've, I, I've heard a lot of great things about <laughs> it, because I think... Uh, I'm not really educated on the God of War series, but I Me neither. But I I've think played. this was like after God of War three. I don't think this was there was anything. Yeah, this is. I think yeah, this is. God and of War I 4. think and God of War three was released in like 2011, 20. I'm not. I'm not. I'm the like, last person. You, but I, all I know is that it uh, it came out, and I got like a free pass, hmm. little thing. Well, someone did and gave it to me. I was like, oh, cool. I don't have a PlayStation 4. So I went to someone's house that I knew had a PlayStation 4 because I'm not paying uh, 300 bucks just for a console, for just for a game I will probably only play once. And then I played it, and then it was fantastic. I loved it. It was just... Mm, mm. Like, it's not perfect. Uh, the story's a bit odd. By art, I mean fucking horrific. It's it, it's something. It doesn't blend well with the characters, because with with Kratos, you know, you expect or, or him, Thanos or whatever the fuck his name is. You expect we'll to, him no, to be. I, uh... I bought up Infinity Wars now. Damn it, we have to talk about that. <laughs> we'll, we'll talk about that later. Oh, uh, so <laughs> I mean, Kratos. Seen. You don't really expect him to be with the son. You expect I, him from I the other to games to be. I wanted him to shed one singular tear, just mm. to show his manly emotions. His, have, you know, someone made a compilation of how many times he says "boy" in the game. It's like five fucking minutes. Boy, boy, <laughs> god of boy, boy of war. So, but I mean, boy. I expect Kratos to be the. You know, a god of war because he took he's down. He's a god of. <laughs> I That's mean, the he name took down game. so many giants and, and gods and, and goddesses. Now, but now he just devolved to spending. I enjoyed time with his son. I, I miss love the I, bits on the boat. Like I, I, I didn't enjoy the whole dynamic of he's actually now grown as a character. He has now has has a family. Well, he has half of a family now. Uh, and it's sort of. Uh, it's nice, but they just sort of, they kind of messed it up a little bit. I yeah, say. I like the old Kratos story where he was, uh... But there was no story. Just kill that thing, mission over, you know, go fuck everything it, else. He up. was a ruthless barbarian killing any god that he wants. Or I think the storyline goes he was betrayed or something, but yeah. it, it was really good. I, if I had a PlayStation, I would probably give it a whirl. Give it a whirl. Okay, so uh, next movie, or I mean next uh, trending topic in America, Infinity Wars. and m maybe uh, other parts of the world, because maybe the movie's not it's out. It's Infinity Wars. Because, you know, uh, Jap uh, Japan doesn't really release uh, their movies until like a month later, I think. And 
Uh, but anyway. Clay, has it come out, out in Japan yet? Do you know? Uh, and what did you think of Infinity Wars, Doug? Did you see it? Well, did you see Infinity? Personally, War? haven't seen the movie, but I heard I the. Uh, I heard that the uh, Guardians were there. You heard? They were in the fucking jail. I heard from an outspoken source. <laughs> Wait, I watched the movie, and I was really tired, so I don't. I actually don't remember anything other than a few bits. Uh, I mean. <laughs> this is Thanos' movie, though. It was sort of just all this fucking. I it was basically another Guardians of the Galaxy movie with the, all other Marvel characters as sort of supporting leads. Uh, I mean, it was good how... Like, I don't know what to think about it. I really do like the villain, Thanos. I like his look. He looks like Homer looks Simpson. Like a, he looks like a, a fucking foodie pebble that has mutated. A foodie pebble that grown that gained sentience. And then was put the fucking fallout. It feels themselves. like Homer Simpson was, uh, he, uh, failed his job at the power plant, and so it turned him into the purple slime. Oh my god, it's like a purple version of, you know that Pokemon of, like, it's just rocks. It's just a bunch of rocks piled on top of each other. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like that, but purple. That's Thanos. Um, that's Infinity Wars. That's all you literally need to know. Uh, Everyone I mean, else dies. Uh, Bati I didn't see a Batista bomb, which I was really fucking sad. Like, I legitimately, I mean, that was the it, only it's reason all I would It's all about see it. uh, Thanos, just, uh, it's all about the fight scenes in the movie. Which there are, and, uh, <laughs> which is all the movie Apparently, it, uh, Disney has, not surprisingly, they broke their sales again. Uh, uh, they made a new record. Apparently, yeah, nearly a, b a billion dollars. In it's like one days. of the top grossing films in North America. It's not one of, it is. Uh -uh. It I is. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> I love the scene where um, uh, Chris Pratt, uh, Star Lord, just is walking through the wreckage. Just, ah oh, man. And he, then he dies. That's good. I uh, really hated it. I don't like, I'm not a big fan of the memes that have help. come out of this, like the dissolving ones. Mm -hmm. Bush, I don't feel so good. Mm. Those, I, I don't feel so good memes, they're, uh, I never really seen what was funny about them. I never, I never enjoyed them. It's Anyways. It's like, them breaking, uh, a uh, certain body uh, part breaking into crystal fragments, like, they're like the bit, the bit things on Twitch. <laughs> Yes. But Next trending topic. Baby, baby. Well, Let's go, go, dog. You're in charge of our trending topic news. Trending topics. So, um, I can't really think. That was really all the trending topics in. Ooh, let's try and travel back to January. Boo! Fuck you, Logan Bob. <laughs> there you go. Uh, yeah, um, so, so far this, uh, year, this is, uh... This has been the, a lackluster year in total. Uh, I in think, uh, today is May, uh, May 11th. It is the 11th of and recording this. So, so far this year has been a sham and in Instagram memes, certain events. Because back in January, it was all about the Thai pods, which if you ate Dude, one, you're just fucking retarded. I'm and sorry. I don't want. We don't want to be associated with those dumb millennials and their fucking Tide Pod challenges. Not everyone eats fucking Tide Pods. And then what was also uh, Logan Paul, a uh, dead body, a uh, 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 we found a dead body. Uh, uh, I know. What if we? <laughs> it's not bringing this up. Uh yeah. And there was the uh, there was the Ugandan knuckles. And uh, if you're wondering what that is, uh, that. Uh, noise was we're recording outside because you what know, noise <laughs> that bird didn't you just hear it you the fool? fucking bird that's over there you, you're not gonna pick that you, up on camera you don't you hear dumbass. that they'll hear that in the no, audio you fool but anyways don't fucking hit me uh, let's get back on topic all right so uh february it was all about um the kid that shot up parkland what was his <laughs> name uh, um uh, nicholas Cruz. Uh, yeah, yeah. Actually, you know Apollo Crews? Yeah. He's now Apollo because Vince McMahon and WWE, he didn't, they didn't want Crews in the WWE ever again. They didn't want the name Crews. He hated he, No more. So now he's Apollo. Now. Uh -oh. Which is really a shame for Apollo Crews. 
Because Apollo sounds like shit. That's a shit name. Uh, what Apollo. Is, is he gonna blow up? Like, is his. What, I wonder what his 13th gimmick will be. Because the 13th Apollo. Is that the one that blew up? Or is that like the challenge? I think that's that Apollo. Cha the challenge will blow up. But yeah. yeah. I'm one of the Apollos. <laughs> yep, just up. like your uh, uh, homemade. <laughs> exploding mix sub special. For those of you who remember that. I, I fucking, I love you, and please, I want to kiss you on the lips. It doesn't matter what gender, race, religion, you know, uh, hey, hey, you it gotta, uh, I don't even care what species you, you are, I will kiss you, I will fucking quench you uh, in the so asshole. So, let's get back on topic about, uh, what the year. So, February, uh, Nicholas Cruz, uh, went into... I think it was north of Fort Lauderdale or something. He shot up his uh, school with the AR-15. And now, uh, it was funny because David Hoggs was the guy that wanted to really uh, uh, stop the guns, you know, gun control. And so, he... <laughs> it's funny because he was eating Tide Pods in January. Now he wants to get... All uh, serious all of a sudden in Who? February. You know, David Hoggs, the CNN crisis actor, as some like to call him. I, I don't know. I don't watch CNN. Because it's weird. I went on his Instagram account. He lived in the uh, Los Angeles area. So and then, what does that have to do with the <laughs> Parkland shooting? Uh, because I'm on the crisis actor topic. And it showed on his Instagram. He lived in Los Angeles. And... Somehow, suddenly, out of all the schools, he moved to Majority Stoneman. Majority Stone. Uh huh. So, that's enough about that. What was the. Uh... He just left. <laughs> what? Oh, let's just not finish that thought because it's going to be bad. Anyways. Right. So, March. No, well, let's talk about. Let's talk about. Uh... No, no, let's, let's talk about uh, all the things that. So, March. No, nothing, nothing happened in March. Yeah, no. Oh, April. Oh, May so far. So shit, that's nice. Anyways. No, no, something happened in May. What happened here? What happened in the month that it is? The month of May. The month of May. Christmas in July. What? You okay? Oh, God. Charlotte, you're liquid. That's a, a reference if you live in the local area that we live in. I mean. What? What reference? You didn't even you didn't say anything. It's it was your blah 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 and like that's a local reference. <laughs> no, you just said furniture liquidators. And that's in our local area. You big there's a furniture liquidators everywhere, dog. <laughs> you... It's not a locally owned company. Okay, sorry, I fucked up. This is my first time being on a podcast. Well, I can fucking tell. Okay. Lumber liquidators is only in our area. <laughs> You clearly don't watch NASCAR, Because if you watch NASCAR in 2010, you would happily see Todd Bodine sporting the Lumber Liquidators. The Lumber, lumber Liquidators. We're not calling it Furniture Liquidators. Oh, yeah, Furniture Liquidators. That one, no, fuck no. it. I've, they're both the two things. The two. Different. Are they owned by the same people? I don't know. Irrelevant things. Oh, my God. We're, we're not even... We're only 18 minutes in. Fucking hell. All right, so March, what really happened? Well, there was the YouTube HQ that got shot up. <laughs> Did that, I? I thought that happened in April. Uh, it may have happened. Yeah, April. I think it, it happened in April. Because nothing April. happened in March. Yeah, May. Nothing. If you know something that happened in March, leave a comment below. But no one watches this podcast, so we need to clickbait the hell out of the title. Right. Oh my God! Is that? Jake Paul? <laughs> <laughs> but, so far, I gotta say, this year has been not been great. It's, um... No, it has. I just realized something. The leaves are on the fucking trees again. I just, like, noticed that. Like, I noticed it, but I didn't, I didn't, like... Hopefully we don't have another incident, like, summer of 2017, where... Jake Paul took over the uh, the summer. Well, on YouTube, fucking killer meme star was reporting all the time about uh, about Jake Paul 
He ordered a fucking, fucking sushi, and it's hard-hitting news in the YouTube community. Because Ooh. yeah, I don't care if Jake Paul. I care if Jake Paul releases a shitty song that becomes a fucking. He becomes a millionaire because off of. A, England is my city. <laughs> you know, it's it's one thing. But sushi. I don't give a shit. He ordered sushi. Everyone likes sushi. If you don't like sushi, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Honestly. Straight up hang. Just hang straight up, kill yourself. <laughs> that hit. Fucking 20 minutes. Oh, uh, I, I know some that happened in May. So, um, this is a topic really relating to you. The Scouts of America. Oh God, yes. If you so, for those of you who don't know, I'm in the Boy Scouts of America. Now the Scouts of America. Because or you know, the Scouts you know, of, it's, as ta- I was ta- Tim was to put it now. It, the Scouts of America. Puts. Yeah. Apparently, it's discrimination, even though we have Girl Scouts. But, Here's the fucking. It's you know. called Boy Scouts. Want to know why? Uh, it's called Boy Scouts. That is two different things. And not one thing for both of them. It's because they don't want them to fuck. They don't want high school students together because they know what's going to happen. High school girl, high school boy, hormones and shit. Running around everywhere. Camping in the woods. And then, boom, someone's getting knocked up in a tent. And then they have to go on camping the next day. I mean, come on. Who wants to go hiking with, with, with um, a fucking uterus full of jizz? No one. And that's the real, that's the real reason why this shit's happening. Yeah. But I can't believe Fucking it. Out. Boy Scouts. So. I didn't, I didn't even catch up on the story. I don't even know how it happened. It, I they, just, uh, just they it. just broke their, I think it was a 102 year tradition, but. No, but how did it happen? Who, is it, well, in. Uh, where, I think. No, <laughs> have you seen the video where it's like. This one girl's at a press conference like, where in boy, where in the Boy Scouts, uh, rule book, or whatever, does it say that it's on, that boys can only join? And he just goes, he's the savage, the mm-hmm. up there on the press box just goes, it's in the name, Boy Scouts. Oh and yeah, fucking that amazing. was that was Ben. Uh, what was his name? Ben Shapiro. I think so. Yeah, yeah, he said that. It was. <laughs> it, it was, was amazing. fucking amazing. I know, just the, the. I don't have a problem. I have a problem with them changing the name of Boy Scouts because fucking. But they, I, I don't have a problem with the concept of let's just combine these two things. But I have a problem with they just start changing everything else to fit that. They can't just make another thing. You know. Yeah. At least, at least one girl's gonna join a troop now. Uh, well. Yeah. It was a and fun. Now, it was a fun sausage fest while it lasted. <laughs> <laughs> it was nice being able to fuck each other in the ass, but now uh, a, j- a vajazzle's now coming into the picture, and it just... It's just it, it, it crosses it out. It, it messes up it's the fucking, sausage chest. Oh, shit. It's, it's discombobulated uh, April, the system. Um, April, uh, uh, Toys R Us uh, Died. shut down. Boom. Uh, you, Toys well, Us. Blockbuster, we all remember it. I mean, it, I loved it. When did they? When did they get? When did they uh, finally go away? Uh, 2013, 20, 2011, 2010. It couldn't have been 2010. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was 2011. But anyways, I th- I th- Blockbuster was up there in the heavens saying, "Come, oh, come, come join to us, us Toys R Us." <laughs> and now Boy Scouts. Now Toys R Us is going, "Come to us, Boy Scouts." <laughs> I mean. And then the CEO, I think, or I mean the founder of Toys R Us, uh, died at age 90, like two weeks after this happened. So yeah. Yeah, fucking hard. Day. Has been a shit year so far. I'm not ex. I'm expecting more bad things to happen. It's been better like, than 2016. Summer. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Better than the Pokemon Go. Uh, Pokemon Go to the polls. Holy shit. Catastrophe. Fucking hell. Um, let's talk about. Let's talk about um, things, and then we'll get into our Truth or Death segment that is coming up because we don't know how to fill time with just us talking. Well, remember? Oh wait, so you you went brought up the rocket thing, the 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 rockets that we made in seventh grade. <laughs> Those things. I called mine the Challenger. Uh, I'll link the video of it in the description. Those of you who know what. Um, Fuck I'm talking about. 
God. My uh, my throat's hot. So that's fine. Right, wait. <laughs> Anyways, on to that. I don't even know why we brought it up. Uh, I fucked uh, it up. Now, back dance. Now. Okay, so. It's time for truth or doubt. Uh, no, I, I'm actually one to talk about it. Topic. Damn it. Start now. Fine. Wait, hold on. What was the topic? 25 minutes. Oh, yeah. You, you, need, you need. We need to talk. Cause truth of doubt only lasts probably 10 minutes. Well, this is only gonna be a 35 to 40 minute podcast. Whatever. Go. All right. So, what did you say you wanted to bring up when I was talking about the events that happened so far this year? I don't know. I don't want to go actually. Uh. So. Um. I can't really, <laughs> there hasn't really been any incidents. Yeah, this is a horrible time to bring up the we're, we're just trying to make up time to, you know. Uh, we can talk about how YouTubers are getting every legend, like, YouTube is just spitting in the face of YouTube legends that are being demonetized. They are. They're just demonetizing them to hell. Oh my God. I mean, there's this guy that has been, uh, that got demonetized, and his videos are getting demonetized up the ass. He makes these puppet videos. Who, me? No. No puppet videos. And so, they're like puppets, plush, and... What is he, fucking Jeff Dunham over here? Well, I, I want to see Jeff Dunham have a Five Nights at Freddy's dummy now. And if I don't see that, I'm going to bond down a f- fucking bond or some shit. <laughs> but anyways, he has been getting demonetized to all hell. He, he has four accounts. Uh, his main account that's been demonetized so he never uploads. His second account, which he uploads videos. Who is this? His name is Super Mario Logan. Logan, you know. Fuck are you? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, uh, Good Morning America did a uh, did a thing on him because January, you know, they both got the same names with um, you know who, and and this was when the media went crazy when he showed the body and Logan Paul couldn't uh, arrive on Good Morning America, so they got. Uh, this, uh, Logan guy, uh, Super Mario Logan, I think, and, because, you know, they needed some Logan, any Logan, because they needed to talk about him and criticize him up the ass, because, you know, <laughs> media nowadays. <laughs> but anyways, he has been getting demonetized, he has three accounts left, and, well, uh, so, out of total, he has five accounts the first main account is down his second one it's getting demonetized but then it's getting monetized as like two hours after he uploads it and he's thinking about moving to his uh one account where he just uploads uh gaming videos but they're like once a year so they're amazing they're uh yeah they're just bad so he has uh that account, his girlfriend's account, and his friend's account. So he has three more accounts. And things are not looking up. He's been getting demonetized ever since December. So, And he was doing just fine. He can do whatever he wants with his videos, you know. But even though YouTube wants to become more kid-friendly, and they're going to demonetize the main YouTube app and all the... uh mature content creators, I mean, even though there's a YouTube Kids app, but... I know, it's such an easy fucking solution to this issue, and they're going, no, only yeah. children use this site, it's adults, what the fuck, what the fuck is that? Even though, you know, we had some legends back in 2008, and we're gonna, uh, we're gonna shit on their front doorstep, but... I feel bad for him. I really hope his uh, YouTube just stops going crazy. And we'll, this podcast may get demonetized, but we don't. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
because we said it. N- okay, I, I didn't even have to say the full word. I did. I'm instantly demonetized. Well, it's not like you make any money. Nigel. <laughs> Nigel. Boom. He's talking about a foreign land as black people. He's racist. Fucking go suck a dick. Says YouTube creator. Alright, so we all be like, what the fuck, dude? And then YouTube's like, fuck you, asshole. And then we're like, oh, oh man. And then YouTube's like, ha 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 ha. Bring on the toy channels. Bring on more Elsa shitting, pregnant Elsa shitting in a bucket. Yes. Yes. All the money. All the money. Yes. I mean, YouTube, it, it's gone. It, it's so it's done. It's over. It, it's their their headquarters are. You know the. Forty scene, minutes. You, you know the scene from uh, SpongeBob where uh, it's they uh, forget his name, so his brain's on fire, and it's like an office space, and then like the whole, whole <laughs> office. That's yeah. YouTube right now. That's what they did ever since like New Year, New Solution. Let, hey, here's the here, solution. Here, here's it's a, not uh, yeah, New Year, New Solution. It's more like the final solution. No, so. wait. New Year, New Resolution. Let's go fucking crazy. Let's demonetize people we have looked at. We've analyzed their content. But let's just start demonetizing, you know. It's, it's PewDiePie. Without it's reviewing PewDiePie. their video. So. PewDiePie said nigga. <laughs> Alright. Yep. PewDiePie said the animal. That bad. That very bad. But it's funny how you no, know, that's the moment that sparked it, because when YouTube saw that their golden child used naughty language, used a really naughty word. No context didn't matter then, because why would it? But I, I feel bad for everyone a part of the YouTube uh, demonetization station right now. Google blood money. <laughs> Terrorist. The, that got the, um, the slingshot enthusiast showing people that knife protection vests are bullshit. Te- and, and fucking this one... It's time, funny those, how... Google blood money. How this one terrorist is uh, YouTube propaganda. It's that? funny how two years ago they had porn videos and Iraq war videos of people getting their... Heads blown off with uh, snipers, and they didn't age restrict that. They, but they would age restrict like a fucking vine compilation, a uh, racist vine compilation. When seeing a racist man vine. get murdered, legitimately murdered on camera, like not like a shot, like a shot gun, like a full fledged fucking, like they put him in a fucking blender, like. Yeah, they wouldn't demonetize that, no. Base boost that death to shit. Bob, you're good. You're gonna rake in the green. Yep. Very tired. We need to stop this. Well, let's see how many more we got. 33 minutes. We got two more minutes, then we can uh, quit this. Oh, we two! We're, we're going Half for 35 long. minutes, you faggot! Alright, anyway, so... <laughs> so... This podcast, uh, it was a uh, first time for Hold me. Hold on. What? There's one more section. This is truth and dare section. No. Dare, no, 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 no. Yep. By truth and dare, I mean yay or nay. Which is what I meant to say all along. Yeah. Because then I said truth and dare, uh, blah, 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 blah. And that's why you got confused. So, the yay or nay section. I, we, we've got random words that you're going to say yes or no to. Yep. It's whether you agree or disagree. Right. And they were sent in by fans. We have no fans. I'm not surprising that we got some. Anyways, we're going to start with the first one. Mm-hmm. Yay or nay, two. <gasps> hentai. Yeah. Hentai, Doug. What's your opinion on hentai? <laughs> uh, or any other comic relief porn? Uh... Yay or nay? I'm gonna have to say nay because anime should just stay in Japan. Because and making pornos of it is worse because it's a unique style, but I, I just can't sit through it. But um, uh, nay. I, I, it's a yay for me. 
You look like the type of guy that will watch anime. It's not. Put a fedora I don't know on you. And you, I called you anime guy 69. I mean, whatever. I mean, they drew it. It doesn't really matter. But, you know, whatever. Hey, if I happen to stumble across some. Um, oh, it, it, it's going to be a good night. Uh, well, there's one more thing. So, April 30th, which was, uh, I'm, I'm 10 days ago. So, uh, Colossal is Crazy. It was his one year anniversary of his, uh, Exposed video. And he has an upload. Yeah, so Colossal Crazy is dead. Uh, the baited podcast doesn't exist. Well, they upload a new episode, like, this Tuesday. So, yay. But he's dead. I know, uh, yeah, uh, uh, he, I went on his Twitter and he posted February 2nd or 24th, he posted upload, you lazy piece of shit, and he, he still hasn't. (laughs) Well, let's make it to like 40 minutes, I want to die, I just want to, alright, this, this next question comes from Anonymous. By anonymous, I mean, that's just the username, anonymous. It's fine. Uh, and it is, the, the the word is lawnmower. Yep. Yay or nay for lawnmowers, Doug? Yay or nay. Yay or nay for are we lawnmower. Talking like, are we talking about the usage of the lawnmower? No, I think the lawnmower itself. Uh, I'm going I'm to go yay for riding lawnmowers and nay for push mowers. Because have uh, you ever done, have you ever fucking did, like... Cut grass with push mowers. It's the most. Uh, fun. It's the worst thing I've ever done. Cut the grass out here on this. Fighting mower. Uh, yeah, I gotta say, riding mower, yay. Uh, electric push motors, yay. But gasoline, diesel, uh, heavyweight uh, mowers, nay. 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 Yeah, nay. Even though. Fucking kill me. Right then. Final yay and nay question for the today. It's coming from the user, again anonymous, because no one sent in their fucking names, because of course they didn't, the scummy bastards. Because, you know, I'm podcast. And it is. Wood. Wood. Yes, they didn't specify. Are we, which wood are we talking here, though? Are we talking tree wood? I mean... Wood, wood, penis wood. Uh, I mean... Wood, uh, Bake wood, real wood. It can uh, warm you up uh, during campfires on a <laughs> cold winter night if you're outside. But who fucking camps outside when it's like fucking January or December? I don't know anyone. It can help you sex the sexy ladies. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it can help you build houses. Yeah, yeah. How yeah. long? 37 minutes. 30. So, uh, this podcast is over in about a minute. <laughs> so, so, this was the first uh, rant page of the... This was the first ever rant page podcast, and it was a shit disaster thing. Yep, the first time, really... and I gotta say, I, I I, just did awful this podcast. I gotta get Everyone did. So, Yo, boy, but next time we'll have a next special guest. A uh, special guest. Doug may not be on it. <laughs> special guest, colossal is crazy. Yes, but seriously, next time we'll have some special guests. Uh, we uh, got, Doug uh, may not be here for reasons of fucking. Uh, uh, we may have um, we may have a uh, we maybe have a two man, three man, maybe one day a five man podcast. But that's supposed to, that that's gonna be the next episode because I've we've got what we've got. I won't be spoiling. Guess so we've got one. Uh, two, so three, we four. got the. Uh, the plus me is. We got five. The, we ha- we have the handsome anime OC. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's episode three. That's episode three. With the smart ginger, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, the the. The dipping me And then, then next episode will probably be the dumb ginger and the fucking cunt faggot. Uh, with the yeah. bad YouTube channel. Uh, yeah. But, so uh, us. Anyway! It's over! Uh, so, uh, make sure to uh, uh, check out our Twitters, even though... Twitters. We- Danger, at Danger Duet and at King HD Games. Or what is Two. it now? At Torturing... At King HD Games. I still King HD Games. 
but my my uh, fake account is a uh, terrorizing danger dude away it's with pictures of lettuce <laughs> go salad boys so so uh any last words Douglas. Uh, uh links for social media will be down below probably not actually this has been the first episode of the baited podcast um we're probably gonna clickbait the title and for a thumbnail it'll probably be a MS a, a, pair, a pair of boobs. It, it will boobs. be a, a, a MS Paint of hot dogs and a, a oatmeal cream pies that symbolize Boy Scouts. Or, I mean, Scouts, when they're in the woods, they may get a, a bit of... Fucking AIDS. They may a, get a, lot, a lot of, of venereal diseases. But this has been the first uh, episode of the Ramp Rage podcast. Like and fucking subscribe, assholes. Uh, Goodbye, amigos. Oh, and fuck off, you fucking tractor trailer cunt. Get the fuck off the road. I hope you crash and die, Bond. I hope your kids never see you again. That was a great way to end it. Oh! So we've got Tim Saints before it's like 41, so I want to make it. Uh, 3, 2, 1! Ad revenue. Fuck off.